I would not want to see it. It will always hurt. Inconsolable, Jennifer Bostic is grieving the loss of her grown daughter, Musi Louise Bostic, killed in a single car crash in Newark early Monday morning. A mother of four on her way home from a late night nursing shift. You can't never take the place of a mother. But a tragic family loss became all the more devastating because the Bostic family had to find out about it on a local media blog. They rushed to University Hospital for more information, but they were told there was no record of Musi Louise in the system. And in the last four days since her death, they have not received a single phone call or visit from police telling them what happened. If they had this incident, why would not they come and tell the parent? The Bostic family was then told to reach out to the medical examiner's office, but they were told they had to do that over email. They couldn't understand why someone wouldn't just call them. We reached out to the medical examiner's office for comment, but they were not available after business hours. Community activists and other local leaders from Elizabeth, where the family lives, called the Newark Police Department, but they say they keep getting the runaround. Family members haven't even been able to identify the body. Uh, the prosecutor's office, we're not going to touch it, so we push it back down to municipal level. Municipal level, no one has contacted the family. We reached out to Newark police, and they confirmed the accident happened 1.30 Monday morning. A car lost control and slammed into this building, but nothing about family notification. So how can she properly mourn or prepare to bury her child when she doesn't, she's, not, she's in the know? She doesn't know what's going on. Then, hours later, an update. The Bostic family finally heard from police tonight after our inquiries. Police say they were originally trying to contact a family member in Newark but couldn't get through. Now the Bostics can begin the process of planning a funeral, but they say no family should have to wait this long to find out about the death of a loved one. Like no consideration, no feelings no more. In Newark, Ida Siegel, News 4, New York.